Sergio Busca's childhood story plus untold biography facts. Sergio Busca's childhood story plus untold biography facts early in family life. Sergio Buscus Burgos was born on the 16th day of July 1988 to his mother, Lili Burgos and father, Carlos Buscus, both pictured below in the Sergio Buscus family photo. Sergio was born into a second-generation footballing family background. He grew up in the Cibital city of Barcelona while playing football with his brother Aitor Buscus pictured with him below, during their childhood. His father, Carlos, was also a footballer, a former goalkeeper of Barcelona who stayed at the club for several years during the 1900s, although mostly used as a backup. Sergio was destined to become a footballer thanks to his father who had always wanted his little boy to follow in his footsteps. Pictured below, his determination to become pro like his dad wasn't a passing fantasy. Loyalty lies in the Sergio Buscus family, his father, Carlos Buscus was a loyal goalkeeper who endured being used as a second choice for years during his time at FC Barcelona. After reportedly losing out on first team competition for the Barca goalkeeping spot, Charles made sure his son, Sergio starred his career at a lower youth academy club. The aim was to ensure little Sergio face less competition and rise to the top. Sergio Busca's childhood story plus untold biography facts career summary. At the age of just seven in the year 1995. Buscus started his footballing journey with local club Badia. After spending a season there, he moved to Sef Barbera Andalusia in 1996 and stayed there for three years. Sergio then joined the Academy of Olida in 1999 due to his father's frustrating decision to leave FC Barcelona. Who frustrated Sergio Buscus' father? Sergio arrived at Lida Football Academy for professional reasons of his father, Carlos, who was frustrated by Louis van Gaal, former FC Barcelona coach, who ran out of patience with him, thus forcing him to leave Barca to sign for Lida. It is pertinent to note that José Moreno pictured below, was the then assistant coach of FC Barcelona when Carlos left. Carlos Buscus painfully went with his whole family among them Sergio, who had to leave his former youth club, Unio Esportiva Barbera to play in Lida where he spent three years. Sergio Buscus rose above all youth ranks, becoming the club's best youth player at his age group as he led his team to win a major trophy. After his dad retired from football at Lida in 2002, Sergio Buscus felt uncomfortable at the club feeling there was nothing else to fight for, hence the need to move to greater youth heights. He got a transfer to Jabok Terrace assigned in 2003 and spent another two year at the academy before being scouted by FC Barcelona Football Academy, La Masia. The rest, as they say, is now history. Sergio Buscus Childhood Story Plus Untold Biography Facts Relationship Life Behind every great man, there's a great woman, or so the saying goes. And behind almost every successful FC Barcelona footballer, there's a glamorous swag or girlfriend as seen in the name of Elena Gale Remoron, pictured with the love of her life below. As at the time of writing, Sergio Buscus is currently unmarried possibly due to some private reasons. However, he has been in a long-term relationship with his partner Elena Gale Remoron whom he met in 2013. 
Their relationship has continued to flourish ever since they met. While the rest of his FC Barcelona teammates were getting married, Sergio who is a millionaire at 30, time of writing, has refused to marry but decided to procreate. On the 8th day of March 2016, Sergio and Elena welcomed their first child and son whom they named Enzo. Below is little Enzo looking very sharp with his parents. A very special moment for Sergio Busca's family is during trophy celebrations, a time when both Elena and Enzo join Sergio with the rest of the FC Barcelona family to milk the moment. Taking vacations with their dogs after trophy celebration moments or end of a season is common to Sergio Buscus and his family. Speaking of dogs, it is pertinent to state that the couple has two dwarf bulldogs named Minnie and Lily who are pictured below. You would easily realize one of the dogs above has close resemblance with the one seen from the earlier picture of Sergio Busca's family. Basically, likeness for dogs is common for FC Barcelona players. Below is Lionel Messi resting with his dog who received a remarkable growth spurt between February to September 2016. Also in April 2018, both Sergio and Delina disclosed on social media that they were expecting a second child. Sergio Busca's childhood story plus untold biography facts stat 2 facts. This particular fact reveals more about Sergio Busca's family history which could have some Arabic traces thanks to his Arabic tattoo on his left forearm. Sergio Buscus Arabic tattoo translates to A thing for you, the life in my country. He dedicates his tattoo to his maternal grandfather to whom both were very close before her death. Sergio Buscus childhood story plus untold biography facts link you facts. Looking very carefully in the photo below, Sergio's lanky appearance denotes some Arabian looks. Sometimes, people have always wondered where Sergio Buscus gets his energy from considering his lanky frame. Off the ball, Sergio Buscus' lanky legs and hands are always put to its vital use. This is seen as he is able to cover ground surprisingly quickly and permanently engage opposing runners of the ball, putting them to a permanent halt. Football players have over time find it difficult to gauge just how big Sergio's hand blocking and tackling circumference is. Sergio Busca's childhood story plus untold biography facts cover trust. Sergio Buscus is quite versatile on the pitch of play. He brings tranquility and a great defense cover in his midfield position. It was because of his ability to provide great cover in the pitch that Carlos Paial offered him the football jersey at the time of his retirement. Without a doubt. A mistake from Sergio Buscus leaves his team's defense in shambles. Sergio's ability to read the game makes it easy for him to make priceless interceptions. It's always difficult to find a like-for-like -like replacement for the Spaniard.